Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Super Shadow, coming to you live with episode 16 of our Supersonic Super Mario RPG-inspired Let's Play. Uh, before we start, if you want to catch the live gameplay recordings and other games that I play, you can follow me on twitch.tv slash isuper underscore shadow with two w's. And be sure to check out the Twitter, follow me on at Emeralds Chaos, and be sure to like and subscribe to the YouTube channel for daily content. Uh, if you remember last time, we just arrived in Monster Town, so now we have some exploring to do. Alright, first things first, there's a hidden treasure here. And we're gonna do this part here first. We can get a key to backtrack to get some good items. This may seem pointless, but we have to talk to this guy like a bunch of times. And he knocks that key down. Oh, and the links to all my social media will be in the description below. But now that we got that key, we can go back and get some stuff that we missed. Nope. Well, we missed this one, and there's one right here, too. Now we need to get a specific fortune. There we go. Now watch this. Since we spent a lot of experience, I mean, we spent a lot of frog coins on the experience booster, we just picked up a bunch here. And some good items. There's a max mushroom, royal syrup, flowers. And a firebomb, which we will be definitely using later. We're going to get rid of the pure water. Now we're done here, and we'll go back to Monstro Town. There we go. I forget what this thing is, so we're gonna fight it. What is this? Makuka. Oh! I think I remember this and I hope it doesn't kill us. Since there won't be really any fights in this episode, this will make up for it. This episode is basically doing some side quests and uh, getting ready to progress the story. But we are getting very close to the end of the game, so it's going to get really exciting and a lot of the fun stuff is coming up. And it's going to be kind of difficult, but we should be okay. I hope. Seems like he, well, he is a cloud. He's doing all electric magic. Here we go. 
Forget what's in here. Oh yeah, this guy tells you about hidden treasures and how many that are left in the world. And that guy talks about the guy in Rosetown. Alright, that guy progresses the regular story. I want to save that for a minute. We're going to do this, uh, uh, check out the item shop. <laughs> Just a minute, I'll be there in a second. <laughs> oh my. Goomba, what are you doing here? Bowser, it's been ages, hasn't it? Sorry about going AWOL on you. I ran away because I was scared to fight Smithy. A lot's happened since then, but look how far I've come. I'm managing the store now. And look, here are my little ones. Come on, show your manners and greet Uncle Bowser. Although I can't fight for you, I still have some items you can use. Maybe you'll find something... You're finding it in your heart to forgive me if I can help you get equipped. Don't worry. I'm not angry with you. I've got new troops now. And we're going to reclaim my castle. You go on with your life here. I wish you the best. Man, Bowser going soft. <laughs> what can I get you? Yo, what? You said you got items for us? And you won't even give it to us for free? Hold on, I need, I need to get pick-me-ups. Just a minute. Oh, never mind. I guess we are good on pick-me-ups. We'll buy the spiked link, because I'm pretty sure it's Bowser's second best weapon. Check here for items. I don't remember where everything is, but we've gotten a decent amount. And now it's this room. If we take a nap in this bed. But yeah, so apparently it seems like Bowser knows some people here. Because they all ran away. And that's why we found Bowser alone. Nice to meet you. I'm Creeper. Hi, I'm the Big Boo. And I'm Dry Bones. We are the three musty fears. <laughs> He's sleeping. Boy, he sure is. Check those bubbles coming out of his nose. Maybe he can still hear us while he's asleep. <laughs> hey you, want to play a round of Find the Flag? So in a nutshell, this starts a mini game, but I know where everything is. Well, not a mini game, it's like a scavenger hunt. We'll hide a flag around the world. Yeah, find all three flags and you'll get an awesome prize. We'll go and hide three flags. See you when we get back. <laughs> They'll be back. I'm back. I hit my flag behind a wooden flower. Rose Town. I'm home, my flag's under a green bed. Mario's house. I'm back, you'll never guess where my spot is. It's between O and A, Yoshter's Isle. But those can be pretty tricky, except maybe the Rosetown one. Our flags are invisible, so search very carefully when you think you found the spot. Don't forget what we told you. All right, so before we progress the story, we're actually gonna go grab those. And go visit uh, Tadpole Pond to get uh, a few things done there also. Yeah, so we go here. Oh, whoops. I wasn't sure what side it was going to bring me in through. Say what up to my favorite color, Yoshi. 
save it up to my other favorite color, Yoshi. Get the flag. We're out of here. Now we go to Rose Town. There's the other flag. Now I'm pretty sure this quest is mandatory, but we're gonna do it while we're here. Then we go to Mario's house. And there we go. Now before we get back to Monstro Town, we're, like I said, we're gonna make a pit stop in Tadpole Pond. Since we're on this side of the world. And say hello to our buddy Froggy, or Frog Fuchsias. And he gives us 10 frog coins and if you remember when we were in Star Hill uh, one of the wishes say I uh, I wish I had my cricket jam but here we go and we're gonna put in the final song for Melody Bay Just a second. Not gonna lie, I have a guide up. But if you wanna find out how to get this song, that star in the one house with the treasure chest plays this song uh, when you click on it. Oh, he's not here. I guess we... Did we already do that? I don't know. I know one way to check, though. This one guy up here should have, I think, fire bombs and ice bombs. Well, we'll check what we have in the frog coins shop. Yeah, these were the bracer and energizers I was talking about before. And crystallines and power blasts. But we have 28 frog coins now because of that one little area. Hold on, that's weird. Oh well. Maybe we, or maybe I messed that up, but. Let's head back to Monstro Town. And guys, uh, let me know in the comment section down below, uh, which is your favorite character in Mario RPG? That's a tough question for me, but I kind of like Mallow. Alright, here we go. And <laughs> Monster Mama. Oh my, traveler from afar, welcome to Monster Town, where many of our kind mingle. I'm the landlady, Monster Mama. A star, you say? Oh, you're here to see our star. She's upstairs, so feel free to go and take a look for yourself. Oh, I think we had to do this first. We'll double check before the episode's over. There's not much left to what we can do here for now, but we will have to come back to fight someone and I'll show that before the end too <laughs> Starbies oh Starbies nope not familiar with them so you came all the way here to search for a Starbies it must be really important this is the last piece or place on land if you can't find it here the only place left is up <laughs> foreshadowing at its finest so you want to go there? Hi, you're an open book. 
Okay, here's what you need to do. There's a secret passage to the sky at Beam Valley. But first, you must scale the cliff beyond the desert to get there. Since you're such a nice guy, I'll introduce you to someone that can help you. Sky Troopers, I need you. What was our flying time? Troops. 8.52 seconds, Sergeant. Sky Troopers, reporting for duty, ma'am. We're 0.52 seconds late. I hold myself personally accountable for the delay, ma'am. <laughs> yeah, so these guys are going to help us up that cliff that we got detoured at when we were in Land's End. Yes, ma'am, anything we can do for a civilian. This fellow here really wants to get to Bean Valley. Could you help him scale the cliff? Understood, ma'am. The orders are get mustache over the cliff. We will succeed. Great dialogue. We will now deploy ourselves to the cliff at Land's End. Troopers, keep a tight formation. We have liftoff. They're odd, but trustworthy. Good luck with your search. Actually, guys, we're gonna go to Land's End and get to right before Bean Valley, I think. And we'll check the Tone of Sky later before we go to a certain part that I'm not gonna spoil. Sleep sauce. Wow, those guys used to take a lot. Now we one shot them. It's crazy how much a few levels can do in this game. Because honestly, there's only 30 levels total. Oh, whoops. I don't think there's anything down here. Oh, whoops. Avoid the geckos. That's fine. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Sonic told me to give Gino magic again. Oh. Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Mario got ultra jump. That's pretty much super jump that hits everybody. And he told me for special for him. But that's a jump for everybody. Or er, a jump that hits everybody. But super jump is overall better for bosses because uh, if you're good, you get 100. Nice, we avoided the bees. Mm -hmm. 
This seems a lot easier than when we were here before. Alright, now we go here. Paratroopers. Now we have to try to get this in a certain time. Basically, you'll see. This is self-explanatory. Ah, oh, crap. And yes, going fast does matter. We get one of the, sp uh, we get the Troopa pin, which is one of the items I talked about, um, earlier. It's one another really good speed item. And then I believe in an upcoming section, we get something called the, uh, fe a feather. And I think those are pretty much all the speed. Oh my goodness. That was my controller. But I'm pretty much, that's all the, sp pretty sure that's all the speed weapons. Or speed armor until uh oh. don't worry I'll get the hang of this guys oh it's the second you jump on this platform it starts so I gotta remember that I think we got it guys Oh no, only a frog coin? Alright, we gotta go faster. Oh, whoops. Come on. There it is. Alright, so now the Troopa pin. In other words, it, it increases speed. Oh, and Gino's level 16, we can switch this around. Okay. Alright guys, we're not going to go too far into here, just up to the first save point, but this is Bean Valley, and if you can guess why it's called Bean Valley, well, they kind of told us we had to go to the sky, so. But we are making good progress through this game. There's really not that much left, guys. I'm having a lot of fun doing this series. This is one of my favorite games ever. Snowy. Awesome. And he said Mallow needs more HP because he's really lacking. Our guys are actually getting pretty strong now, which is good. I'm very happy for that. No, I don't want to do that part yet. Where is the save point? I know there is one. And if not, I'll go back and this will count as a preview. Oh, there's a once again. I don't think we've had one of those in this run yet. And if we have, it was a while ago because I don't remember. But once again allows you to, as it says, attack once again. We didn't go in here. 
Oh, what a troll. Here's the new spell, guys. And girls. And whatever. Whatever you think you are. Or identify as, sorry. I didn't mean to make that sound wrong. But yeah, now we have a snowman. That's basically like, th like an upgrade to uh, Thunderbolt. Okay, cool. But alright guys, that concludes another episode of the iSupersonic inspired Super Mario RPG Let's Play. Uh, like I said, uh, please like and subscribe to the channel for more content daily. And follow the Twitter at Emeralds Chaos and my Twitch for live gameplay of this and other games at iSuper underscore Shadow with two W's. The links will be in the description below. And next time we'll be taking on Beam Valley. Shadow.